Coney Island rented part of their park to promoters who had a similar pool party here last summer, but they were told this time around crowds had to be smaller. And when they grew, deputies threw people out. Coney Island's name trended on social media after videos we can either verify or show without permission made waves. According to a park spokesperson, SNS Entertainment and 160 Promotions rented part of Coney Island for a Saturday party with star Lil Boosie rapping. Promoters sold 1,200 tickets, 300 less than allowed. Coney Island managers told organizers to let no one else in and to enforce social distancing rules. Neither happened. After Governor Mike DeWine's stay-at-home order shut down Ohio businesses, the park reopened in June with new rules to protect people from coronavirus. Fewer guests, no one with cold or flu-like symptoms, groups stay six feet apart, no moving chairs or tables, and managers also encourage people to wear masks. A park spokesperson says Saturday's guests refused to stay socially distant. So Hamilton County Sheriff deputies working security escorted everyone out. They had no trouble and made no arrests, but social media videos showed after parties. Coney Island managers cannot confirm where those happened and promoters did not return calls or messages. Hamilton County's health department says those involved faced no further punishment though, and Coney Island did everything by the book. Park leaders say workers sanitized every area used last weekend and are prepared to enforce the rules on anyone coming to Coney Island. Larry Seward, WCPO 9 News.